quiero. Ok, my dearest, my intelligent students. Number one, thanks for always begin on time. Ok, so, but before to start with the dynamic, with these exercises, please let me know if you can hear me, ok? Let's see, hello, Jessica. Hello, Jackie. Hello, Paola. Hello, Tati. Nancy Hello, teacher. Still, okay, perfect. Thank Hello, you, Jessica. Teacher. Thank you, Tati. I think Nancy is, is having problem with her internet. Okay. So, Jackie, can you hear me? Paola, can you hear me? Yes. Perfect. Nice. Okay. Okay. With a little bit problems. Okay. Thank you, Ligia. Good evening. Welcome. <clears throat> How are you doing? Perfect. I'm just trying. I'm just trying if you can hear me, okay, ladies? Let me see. Hello, Fabi. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Perfect. Really nice. I don't know. Ligia, what about you? Can you hear me? Yes, perfect. Because yes, I need to... Teacher. Perfect. Excellent. Really nice. Welcome, my dears. Because I need to let you know the instructions, okay? Estoy haciendo eso porque quiero que verdaderamente me escuchen, porque necesito dar ahí las indicaciones. Okay, my dear students, for today's class is totally, totally different with the previous classes. Why, teacher? Because if you see, today we are going to finish this test. We are going to finish to analyze this reading, okay? So, if you see, I got 10 words. Look at, the first one is beautiful. The second is, déjenme mover esto por acá porque si no, no miro. The second is, permítanme, vamos a ver acá. Ok, let me see. Wait, wait a minute, please, wait a minute. Uh, yeah, Nancy, your camera is open, ok. I don't have problems with if you want to have it, open it, but yes, your camera, Nancy, is open. I don't have problems, ok. I don't have any problem about it. Ok, guys, so if you see, today we are going to conclude with the text. With this reading, okay. Some of you yesterday were giving different kind of topics, and today the most important is if you have the knowledge, if you have the capacity to look for synonyms. For example, I got 10 words beautiful, brightly, sets, past, crops, destroys, problems, chemicals, unfortunately, and the last one, unpleasant. The Activity, the dynamic, the exercise is very simple, guys. For today's class, it's not necessary to participate. It's not necessary to give your point of view because yesterday you did it. For today's class, you are going to look for the synonyms. I got 10 words. You are going to look a synonym for beautiful, a synonym for blindly, a synonym for sets, a synonym for past, crops, etc., etc., etc. But be careful, guys. For example, in the part of the speech, what is beautiful? It's a verb, it's a conjunction, it's an adjective. What is beautiful? It's an adverb. Adjective. Exactly. So that means you have to look for an adjective synonym. No me puedes reemplazar la palabra beautiful por un verbo. No me puedes reemplazar la palabra beautiful por una por una contractions. No me puede por una conjunctions, perdón. No me puedes reemplazar la palabra beautiful por un en este caso por un adverbio. Me doy a entender. Si usted va a buscar un sinónimo, tiene que tener la misma estructura. Ahora bien, for example, brightly. What is brightly? It's an adjective. It's an adverb. It's a verb. It's a no. conjunction. What is brightly? Uh huh. Adjective. Adjective too. Adverb. Adjective too. Okay. So, Adjective. exactly. But but look at what is destroys. <clears throat> what is destroys? Is an adjective too? It's an adjective, destroys. A uh hax. -huh. No one really, my goodness, what it destroys in the part of the speech, guys? Adjective, bear, conjunction, adverb, yeah. article. Exactly. The point is, if you are going to look for a synonym, respect the part of the speech. Okay, so teacher, it's necessary to write it down 
all the text? Yes. ¿Qué, teacher? Es que solamente eso vamos a hacer hoy. Usted me va a escribir todo el texto, ya sea en una hoja de papel, en un cuaderno, lo que usted se le haga más fácil. Lo único que usted va a hacer es, si usted utiliza, por ejemplo, en la mayoría o en lo general, el color azul, las 10 palabras yo necesito que usted me las haga en rojo. Por ejemplo, yo comienzo acá. Moth are closely related to butterflies, but they are not necessary as often because they are not as. Entonces, this word, the synonym of beautiful, please try to write it down, for example, in red or in blue. I don't know. So, it is necessary to write it down all the text. Yes, it is necessary. And then, you are going to work in your notebook. And then you are going to send to me by taking a picture and send to my private WhatsApp. Guys, we got 10 words and every single of them got one point. So it is clear or it's not clear, guys. Let me know, please. Five, four, three, two. Uh, oh, my God. Sería, teacher. Yes, Sería please. Como cambiar la, 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 la oración, ¿verdad? La palabra que está subrayada. La palabra. Yes. Mm -hmm. O sea, el... pero digamos así como esa beautiful es como. Hermosa, no demos copia, no demos, eh, no demos copia. Ajá. <risa> no, pero, pero sería como un ejemplo, sería como feo, sería, digamos así, cambiarlo, vaya. digamos. Exacto, pero ahora, okay. beautiful, beautiful, no lo puedo reemplazar por un, un, un sinónimo opuesto, porque entonces ya no sería un sinónimo, sería sí. un antónimo. Entonces, uh -huh. yo quiero que para las 10 palabras no quiero antónimos, quiero sinónimos. O sea, en vez de beautiful... Todo el párrafo, ¿verdad? Exacto, Hay que escribir. exacto. Yo creo que es la primera vez en el, todo el tiempo que tenemos de estar juntos que los voy a poner a escribir tanto, porque necesito que practiquen también la escritura. No necesito que me participe, porque eso ya lo hicimos ayer. Lo que necesito es que me transcribe el texto, pero las 10 palabras, cámbiemelas. Y trate la manera de no buscar, porque ayer estuvimos discutiendo casi todas las 10 palabras, pero trate la manera de no buscar en Google Translator o trate la manera de no, de no ayudarse del Internet. Mídase usted solito, mida usted, usted sola. How many words do you know? How many synonyms do you know? Ok, so, another question, my dearest, or everything is clear. Five, four, three, two. Okay, so, but yes, in my case, I got a question. Do you consider it's necessary to be in class or not? This is your option. Teacher, I would like to continue in class because if I have any question, okay, I have the opportunity to ask to you. But no, teacher, in my case, my internet is not working. Okay, can I leave the class and send the picture? As soon as possible, cuando digo as soon as possible, significa que eso me lo tiene que mandar a más tardar hoy a las 9.45 pm. So, mi pregunta es, ¿quieren que estemos conectados? ¿O lo hacemos nosotros solo y me los manda al WhatsApp? Teacher. Yes, Jessica. My internet failed for a while, so can you explain it again? Please, because I yes. can't hear anything. Yes, of course, a pleasure. I'm sorry, I'm no, no, sorry. No, no, no way. <laughs> no way, a pleasure. Okay, I'm going to explain it again. Look, at, I got the test. I got this reading. The, this reading was the previous one that we were reading yesterday and discussing. So if you see, Jessica, I got 10 words online. Beautiful, brightly, set, pest, crops, destroys, problems, chemical, unfortunately, and unpleasant. So, number one, Jessica, and the rest of the students, you are going to write it down all the text in your notebook. But what happened or what we are going to do with the words in bold? You are going to look for a synonym for beautiful, a synonym for brightly, a synonym for sets, a synonym for past, a synonym for crops, etc., 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 etc. When you finish, when you finish, you are going to take a picture and send to my private WhatsApp. And remember, we got 10 words. It means like a, every single of them has one point. Significa que cada una vale un punto. So, it is clear, guys, or not? 
Let me know. Yes, teacher. Perfect. Thank okay. you. No, you're Sorry. welcome. No, 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 please. No, this is my business. Okay, no, no worries, please. Yes, Walter, you got a question? Let me know because can you're a pain. Yeah, can Jessica. I ask you something? Uh, is it necessary to be in the class or I can leave? Yes, it's your option. Yes, that's the question that I was asking to all of you. So, guys, what do you think? What do you want? It is necessary to be connected in class or not? This is your option, okay? Ustedes son mis jefes. Yo hago lo que usted me diga, hacks. But I need to listen to opinions. In my case, I can't teach her because my internet is, is, okay. is failing a lot, so. Okay, no worries, please. But please try to send to me before, before 9.45 p.m. today, okay? This is for okay, today. Thanks, Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Let me see. Let me see. Yeah, okay. Veo que Berito me acaba de mandar un mensaje. Okay, please. So, guys, okay, I'm here. If you need my help, I'm here, okay? So, guys, please do it. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Thank you, teacher. Nice, nice. A pleasure. Vamos a contestar aquí. Creo que Berito me mandó. Vamos a ver, ok.
teacher? Yes. You remember me? What does it mean? Best? Best. 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 Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Welcome. Chicos, traten de mandarme una foto así lo más clarito que puedan porque eh, las voy a, a descargar para ponerlas en la presentación para compararlas mañana, para comparar vocabulario. Porfa, si alguien entró eh, un poquito tarde y no sabemos ahí la indicación, déjenme saber, ¿ok?
Okay, my dear, is 10 minutes, 10 minutes left, okay? Okay, teacher. You're welcome.
Okay, my dear, is four minutes, four minutes left.